Hi, my name is Chuck Tuck and I'm part of the Aver team. Thank you for joining me today on the Aver PowerPoint presentation, learning to use the Aver PowerPoint plugin Spotlight and Visor features. Also remember to visit us at www.averusa.com. So if you're ready, let's go ahead and get started. You notice once again, I have my slideshow already set up on the left hand side. Now once you've installed the Aver PowerPoint plugin, you'll find a tab to the far right that says Aver. When you click on Aver, it'll bring up some tools here. Today, as I said, we're going to be talking about the Spotlight and Visor features. I'm going to show you something real quick as I run through and click on the different slides here. On this particular slide, we're going to have the a live Aver document camera image underneath and we have to be in the slideshow presentation mode in order for you to see the actual image. But what I want to do before that, since I'm going to use a spotlight on this one, is I'm going to click to highlight spotlight. When I do that, once I run the live presentation, it will know that this particular slide will have a spotlight designated for it. Also for the next one, you already see that I have the visor clicked. So when I come to this slide in the live presentation, it would already be set up for the visor. So let's go ahead and start from the beginning so you see exactly what I mean. Okay, come up to slideshow and we're gonna start from the beginning. And again, it says learning to use the Aver PowerPoint plugin Spotlight and Visor features. You see here, we have that one area already set up with the spotlight. You do have some other controls. Click here, we wanna have this as a semi-transparent. That way we can read where it says find the 38 cent ad in the paper. So now we're actually able to move this around and there's a 38 cent ad. If we want to have this set up as a rectangle or square, we can set that up and resize it to whatever size that we need. Okay. Now let's go on to the next. Right here is the visor and it's just a matter of grabbing moving your visor up and down. So you notice that I don't have a live image placed in this one, but you're still able to use the visor and spotlight features within the PowerPoint presentation itself if you do not need or want to use the actual document camera in that particular slide. Again, to your far right here, in the upper right-hand corner, you can make this a semi-transparent. But for most of us in this case, we're probably going to want to use a, a non-transparent level. This is very good for if you're going to have questions and answer line by line. You can drag and control how much of it that you want to reveal. If you want to split the screen in half, you can do just that. Okay. And you notice I could go left to right or right to left, top to bottom, or we could go from the bottom up. Okay, so that was our quick tutorial today for the Aver Visor and Spotlight feature. Remember, you can always visit us at www.averusa.com or for any support, you can call us at 1-877-528-7824 or email us at support.ppdusa at aver.com. This is Chuck Tuck. Thank you very much.